Before she became a physical therapist, Kayla Borchers was a competitive runner. And even though she worked her core, she had consistent low back pain. It felt like just muscle tension and just a dull ache. It's a common complaint among runners, not to mention couch potatoes. So to find the cause, a team at the Ohio State University Wexner Medical Center examined muscles runners use during running. Using motion detection technology and force measuring floor plates, experts built joint and bone simulations that allowed them to do virtual strength manipulations of different muscles. What if you turned off certain muscles so they were weak, fatigued, not well conditioned? What does that change then? What other muscles would have to take up the slack? And, um, and what are the effects of that? They found that back pain is commonly caused by weak, deep core muscles that are used to stabilize the spine. That's different than the surface muscles like the abs that many people typically focus on. If those deep core muscles are not contributing, then that's increasing or likely to increase the loads on your spine in a way that may lead to low back pain. So Dr. Chaudhary says skip the sit-ups and opt for Pilates-type exercises that force you to hold your body in place. Things like planks, especially on unstable surfaces, strengthens those deep core muscles that will reduce back pain for runners and even armchair quarterbacks. Experts say there's a lot of misinformation out there on the best way to strengthen your core. Anything with a large range of motion is probably just working those sexy beach muscles and not doing enough to strengthen that all-important deep inner core. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News.